man, if my animals look this good, man, I gotta be doing something right, bro. If you ever go to somebody's house and they animal setup is disgusting, I mean, that should let you know all about what they doing for their animals. It ain't about the animal. Everything that I do is for the animals. I'ma give them the best possible life I can. Literally. See, look at them. I'm trying to shell nesting balls. And there's three other ones. Three other nesting balls and they fighting over one. That's crazy. But yeah, man, I keep telling y'all, you don't need a chicken coop if you want chickens. Just secure your chicken run, keep them out the elements, and I mean, let your chickens be happy, man. Man, there's no reason why y'all chickens should be looking nasty and disgusting, bro. I mean, y'all chickens should literally look this good. Y'all eggs should literally look as good as mine. I mean, if some of y'all eggs come out nasty, it's okay. It's just letting you know that the chicken's organic. You feel what I'm trying to tell y'all? If I tell y'all a duck could pull a truck, it looking like y'all better hook his ass up with that big trucking, buddy. It's that Rasta country, motherfucker, man. I ain't new to it. I'm true to it, buddy. It's in my blood, bruh. Beautiful chicken pen, bruh. And we building one more over there. I'm going to show y'all the little bitties I just got. Show y'all these little bitties. Get y'all butt back. Lock them back up in there. Show y'all the bitties I just got. So we bought this chicken coop. Um, didn't feel like building another one. It makes a great brooder pen though. I mean, see the little baby bitties in there. Makes a great brooding pen though. They got plenty of space. I don't have to clean it out as often. Plus, I don't like keeping chickens inside. I'd rather have them outside. 